So y'all, today I'm making some honey barbecue jerk chicken for the first time. If you're from the Caribbean, you already know what we do out there. We gotta clean our chicken. We clean it, clean it, clean it. Make sure we take out all the nasty fat and everything. Then you put some lime and vinegar and some hot water. And these are the things I seen in my meat week. So I use some Jamaican jerk, some egg piece, some complete seasoning, onion powder, garlic powder, some sazon, black pepper, salt. And I added some green peppers and onions to it as well. And I let it sit overnight in the fridge so it can marinate real good. And y'all see that? Mm-hmm, that thing real seasoned. I put my oven up to 375 and I went ahead and I laid my chicken down. Them things finna be busting with flavor. Ain't nothing bland over here, okay? I forgot to tell y'all, but I also put some Maggi, aka chicken bouillon in it too. Then I added some water cause I needed some gravy cause I'm finna do chicken and sauce on the side. I basted my chicken every 20 minutes, putting the broth over it so it could be real juicy and real good. And that gravy was fire. And I'm finna use this to make my chicken and sauce and to add to my barbecue sauce. I put it back in the oven because I needed my chicken to be tender, falling off the bone. And look at that. Mm-hmm. That look good. I did some rice and some bun on the side. I started to make my sauce with some peppers and onions and some tomato paste. I cooked it down, added some of the gravy. I added some of the chicken and a scotch bonnet pepper and let it cook down. Now I'm making my barbecue sauce with some brown sugar. And I'm finna add some of the gravy to my barbecue sauce. When you add the broth to it and make your own barbecue sauce, it adds a different type of dimension of flavor. I can't explain it, but it tastes too good. Then I added some cayenne pepper because I like my food spicy. I poured the barbecue sauce on top and I put it in the oven on broil so it could get nice and golden brown. And I also did some broccoli on the side. I let it broil for a couple minutes so the sauce could get all up in that chicken. And look at that. Mm-hmm. That looks too good.